check it out, Sharers. Today we're here in the beautiful state of Utah because we're going to drive the world's first and only Tesla Roadster. <laughs> It's absolutely gorgeous today, but it's also absolutely freezing. There's even snow on the back of the mountains there. So turn up the jams, boot play, and wham. You better dance and not just listen. That's how you know how cold it is. And to make things worse, last night we went over to the Bingham's house and did the polar plunge. <laughs> it is seriously so cold. I'm just waiting till the towels come. Why are you still <laughs> She's frozen. And I'm still defrosting from that, but I might freeze again because today we're driving the world's first and only Tesla Roadster. Oh! How's it even possible we got our hands on the world's only Tesla Roadster? Well, come with me. Let me show you what it's all about. First stop is this abandoned mall. Well, it's not really abandoned. Let me show you what we're doing here. Yeah, we're here at Automotive Addiction, and they have some of the coolest cars here ever. As the shift stick, it's a grenade. Definitely don't want to hit the wrong part of that. And the best part is this car actually works. And there's so many cars this way. Resvani? I don't even know what this thing is called. It's called a Resvani Beast. It was built in 2015, and look at this thing. The doors on this thing, I don't even know how these doors would work. I guess you pull them back and put them in here. This way, and then boom. Look at the back of this thing. The brake lights are like one thin line. The exhaust comes out right there. The engine honestly doesn't look too impressive. The interior doesn't look that impressive either. It kind of looks like an old car. But the exterior of this thing with the doors is just the coolest thing I've ever seen. But this place has so many more cool cars. Like, check this one out. 1989 Lamborghini Countach 25th Anniversary Edition. This is just like Carter's Lambo, but this is white with a tan interior. Whoa, check this one out. Yeah, sure. Is this a car that I feel like not many people have? This is a Maserati MC20. I think they are really, really cool. They got the doors that go up. The interior is always so cool. The black with the blue. And then back here, you got the awesome exhaust coming out the back like this. It looks cool but there's so many other cool cars here and none of them are going to compare to the Tesla Roadster that we're about to drive today. Yeah. Ferrari 458, these are becoming more and more rare. This white is super fresh and clean and it's got a tri exhaust. Kind of the body of it kind of looks like a McLaren. Oh, and speaking of my car, check this out. There we go. This is the exact car I have. This is a 600 LT McLaren, but or this one is actually a coupe, so it's not a convertible. This one actually has the rims that I wanted, but now that I look at it on this car, I'm not sure I wanted these rims. They are cool but I might actually like my rims better. Instead of carbon fiber, they just do this like gray color here. It still looks good, but I do think the carbon fiber gives my car an extra pop. Even this rear bumper on mine is all carbon fiber versus this one is just all this gray plastic. Ooh, and this is cool. This is a classic Porsche 914. Fun fact, my grandfather actually used to have one of these, but it was before I was born. So I've actually never been in one, but they look very cool. So I'm gonna send a picture of this Porsche to him on Instagram. Which, by the way, if you're not following me, make sure to follow me on Instagram right now. What? Old cars had the coolest interior. Here. This is an old Ford Thunderbird. Look at this. And then look at the back of this. The brake lights on this thing. No way. They have the exhaust going through here. That is so cool. They don't do that on cars anymore. Come check out this car. Look at it. It's a butterfly up front. Look at that. What? It's like painted rims. Whoa, this car's got wood. And then it's got wood on the inside. Wood up here. What kind of car is this? This is actually so cool. Is that gold? Pedals? If anyone has any ideas what kind of car this is, comment it down below. Which also reminds me, Shares, we gotta give away free merch in today's video. As you know, we always give away merch in every single video to one random commenter. And today we got some really cool merch, like this awesome classic Share the Love tee. And these shirts are completely sold out in the merch store. So the only way to get this one is by commenting on today's video. One of two things. Comment on this video, let me know what kind of car this is. And you can also comment on this video, Tesla, because we're about to drive the world's first and only Tesla Roadster. Oh! Comment Tesla down below right now for a chance to win this awesome free merch. I absolutely love Hummer H1s. These are so cool. But fun fact shares, we actually are about to go see a Hummer H1 and it's actually going to be, say a little bit cooler than this because it's not going to have an engine in it at all. What engine? How's that gonna drive? Whoa. Okay, so we're literally seeing how this thing actually works. Oh, and we got a white Cherigini here. This one looks good with the gold rims. But shares, this honestly might be a car that I wanna get. Let me know what you think. This is a Lotus Elise in lime green. Obviously this has had some upgrades to it, but the green and the black look so cool. It's got carbon fiber mirrors, green air intakes here, green on the rims, a green wing. It matches my green share the love shirt. It's got a Tesla engine in it. It's super reliable. Look at the rear diffuser here. It's even got what I did on the McLaren. And there's even orange striping for the carbon fiber diffuser. The, the green accent details on it. I think this thing is really cool. I think I have to get a Lotus Elise as my next car. It is definitely not going to be as fast as Tesla Roadster that we're about to drive today. Oh, oh my goodness. Because apparently shares this Tesla Roadster that we're about to drive today goes zero to 60 in 2.5 seconds. Oh. 
Yes, yeah, guys, comment down below right now, Tesla, and let's head over to the inventor's house who designed and built this Tesla Roadster by hand. Eat it up, eat it up, eat it up, eat it up, yum. Yeah. Yeah. Eat it up, eat it up. Eat it up, eat it up, yeah. Real quick, shares, we're gonna make a pit stop here at Fizz Drinks because we were hanging with the Binghams last night and uh, they did tell us that they have their own custom drink here at this store. The Berry Bingham, the Bingham Bash, available literally on the menu at Fizz Drinks. You go up there, you can order it, they'll know what to make, and you will get that delicious, gorgeous pink and blue drink. It's very good. So let's see what they have. Ooh, and it smells like soda. It smells good in here. Hi, welcome to Fizz. What can I get for you guys today? Can I get the Bingham Bash? Of course. Can I get the Berry Bingham? Of course. This is the Bingham Bash. Bash. It's got whipped cream, it's got ice cream in it. Oh, this is really good. The Berry Bingham. Whoa, that was really good. Shout out to the Binghams for having their own drink here. Now that we're hydrated, let's go drive the Tesla Roadster. Woo! Oh, and check it out, shares. We are here. This is the first project that Jeremy is working on. And by the way, we gotta show you who Jeremy is. This is Jeremy, the creator of the Tesla Roadster. What is going on? Thank you for having us out here. So the first project he ever did was the Tesla Roadster. This is his second project. I'm gonna show you this first. This is a, a Humvee, but there's something special to it. You wanna show us what it is? Yeah. So as you know, Humvees are super, super gas guzzlers, but this one is way different than that. It is a fully electric Humvee made with Tesla batteries and a UQM motor. I don't know what that means, but it's basically a Tesla-fied Hummer and it's completely open in the back here too. These are the batteries. This is kind of some of the brains of the operation. You can literally see everything right here. You got the little charge port right here. And what's the kind of range you get on this thing? About 200 miles. As you know, I love Hummers. My brother just got a Hummer H2 monster truck. Chill, chill. Carter. This is how tiny it is. I got this much room for my legs. You got the giant thing here, which is the transmission. And you got the driver's seat way over there. Oh, is there a digital screen on this thing? Yeah. All right, and Jeremy's gonna do a startup. Oh, look at that screen. That is so cool. That's a Lamborghini screen. So what, it's on now? It's on. Oh, cool. You can see all the coolant tubes working right there. All right, Grace, hop in. Oh, where do I get in? It's a Hummer, it can fit as many people as you want, so just climb right in. Here we go. World's first military Hummer that's electric. This is so cool, what? Oh, this thing is wide. What? This is so cool. It's all electric. With the Lamborghini dashboard right there. That is so cool. Oh, yeah. How's the weather back there, Grace? Um, it's a little scary with no door, but... Oh, what is under here? Whoa. Okay, so we're literally seeing how this thing actually works. A massive motor right there. Transmission spinning there. Whoa. The entire motor right here. Cheers. This is so cool. And this isn't even the Tesla Rosa that we are about to see. What in the world? Cheers. Look, there's even spots for an M16 rifle here. So this was a legit military Humvee. Military Humvee yeah. Now I want everyone to smash the like button right now because we're about to go inside to this top secret garage and see Jeremy's world's only first and ever Tesla Roadster. This thing took three years to build. It's got 600 horsepower. That's right. It's super fast. And uh, it's got really cool doors. All right, let's go in. Everyone smash like button right now. This thing is so cool. Back, back, oh, back, check back, this back, thing out. The Tesla Roadster. How cool is this thing? And it is actually so low to the ground. And this is real carbon fiber. All handmade. We got carbon fiber headlights, LEDs here, suspension sticking out right here. We got the Brembo brakes on here, carbon fiber side view mirrors, carbon fiber on the interior too. Look at these seats. And also look at the back of this thing. Look at this. What? Oh, it's got a backup cam. What? We came all the way out from Pennsylvania to see this thing. What? Look at this, when the doors are up, that is the coolest thing ever. Yeah, what would you call this color? What is this color? Sub-Zero. Sub-Zero Blue. World's first and only Tesla Roadster. Watch your head. Squeeze it in. Oh wow, it is a tight squeeze. There we go. I'm in the Tesla Roadster. Okay, ready? Whoa, what? So it's fingerprint, so basically only I can figure out. No way. Uh, Whoa, what? No way. A fingerprint technology car. This is all digital here. Push to start with fingerprint technology. And this is actually how you put it into gear. Wow. And then what does the red button do? That's your park brake. And then that tells you what, how much voltage you have or? The high voltage system is right here, the 399. Okay. And does that mean what, we got a full charge right there? Yeah, 400 volts is full charge. Oh. And how much range do we get on this thing? 125 
And what's this 11 C thing? Okay, 11 degrees Celsius. You gotta try to sit in this thing, Grace. It's a little hard. Oh, there you go. That fits you nicely. It's very low, though. I feel like we're literally on the ground. Yeah, this is low. Oh, no way. Now that it's on, Grace, look at the back. Look at this thing. What? That is the coolest angle ever. I'll share this. To power this thing, it's got one Tesla motor. Check this out. To open the hood, you pop the plate down. And there it is. Tesla motor that powers this thing. It's a Tesla motor from a Tesla Model S performance. To uh, charge it, you pop the license plate down, you charge it right there. And this thing is gonna be super fast. <laughs> Because not only that, but if you want to see more of how Jeremy does this stuff, he actually has a whole channel on how he builds every single one of his builds from the Hummer to the Tesla Roadster to this brand new project that he's doing. He's making this Porsche into an electric Porsche with two motors. All the uh, body panels were damaged in a crash. This was a salvage one. So we're going to be making our own body panels. So again, we're going to make it look really sweet. And not only that, this is going to be the world's only all-wheel drive Porsche Cayman with electric motors, which means it's going to be super, super fast. How much horsepower do you think it's going to put out? 900. 900 horsepower. This thing puts out 600 horsepower. This is gonna be 900 horsepower. We gotta test out what 600 electric horsepower feels like in this Tesla Roadster. I'm riding passenger. Oh, this is much easier to get in on this side. Okay, so when you're gonna be driving, you need to know kind of steering wheel in case you need to get out. This one, you slide it over like this. So if you need to get out, push this button. This one rotates this way, you take it off. So a removable steering wheel. I've never been in a car that's had that. Okay, seat belts. So it's a five point, all of them connect to the center. Three, four, slash five. All right, going for a ride in the world's first Tesla Roadster. This is crazy. This is so cool. Oh, I can already tell this is fast. You can see the suspension working. <laughs> Whoa! Oh my goodness. What? What? Oh, this thing is so fast. Oh my goodness. What? I'm gonna drive this thing? Oh, we get to drive the world's first Tesla Roadster. Whoa, check that. I love the doors on this thing. And now, Sherry's, it's my turn to drive the world's first Tesla Roadster. Check this thing out. Doors down. All right. I'm about to drive this Tesla Roadster. This is absolutely crazy. Literally, carbon fiber everywhere. It is so fast. Zero to 60 in 2.5 seconds. <laughs> That is why we have five point racing harnesses on. I've never seen any car have this. We're going. I'm afraid to step on this pedal. I can't believe how quiet this thing is. So quiet. Oh my goodness, what? Oh! <laughs> it's so fast. So fast. This thing is so fast. Oh! Sherry, this thing is so fast. If you press the gas too hard, you literally burn out and you can smell the tires just melt. It is crazy fast. Hang on, we're going around a turn. Okay. Here we go. Hang on. <laughs> this thing handles well. I'm a little tall where my eyes are right by the windshield and my head's above the windshield so I get all the air, but it, yeah. it does feel good. I'm not really sure why everyone's looking at us. Is that because they know who we are? No, Steven, it's because we're driving the world's only Tesla Roadster. Oh, right. <laughs> it safely, which I'm so surprised. How was it? Whew, that was crazy. This cool. is definitely my favorite car. Cheers, I might have to have him build me one. This thing is seriously so cool. I knew it would look cool. And the coolest thing is the suspension here, you can actually see moving while you're driving. It is literally the coolest thing ever. All together on this holiday, all together it's time to celebrate.